I'm almost done with the uh, the concept sketch. Um, been refining a few things, and I'll point those out as I go down. But the this this uh, uh, the head area here, I've taken a few things off the photo, um, I, everything off the photo, uh, the certain characteristics, uh, including um, there's some teeth up here, and for an example. Like this is the salmon that I did. Like these teeth here, I'm gonna incorporate in this little tiny pocket here. So another example is, this is one of my smallest carvings, okay? If you zoom in, get a good look up at all the detail on this thing. Now imagine all this detail in this thing. So this is the typical size of a bluegill right here, just a head alone. And we go down, um, working on uh, some different scale patterns. This is kind of like a three cut and it's more of a diamond and then this is rounded. Come down here, uh, over the course of a day, I've actually dropped this down, move this back, made the fin a little bit smaller. The same with this one. This is positioned a little bit differently. What I'm going to have to do is um, I owe another inch on this drawing. So this is not even anywhere near being done right now. I got to, what I'm going to end up doing is I'm going to take some tracing paper. I'm going to start at the beginning. I'm going to tape all the sections together, trace this thing out. And then sand the wood down to the bare wood, transfer it back on the wood, because you'll see here, this is a pretty good distance up here, not so much down here. So I'm going to center this better. Um, it's going to look uh, way better positioned on this board. I'm going to give myself another inch where... Here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get a little, I'm going to add about a half inch over here and then a half inch over here by splicing the uh, pieces of tracing paper uh, together, making them longer. And then another thing I did with the tail is this here is my 42 inch line right here. Um, the tail itself is kind of angled up. When you looked at it, it looked odd it just looked you know um kind of like, like hanging there so i moved the tail up made it more symmetrical and i'll get another shot uh, of the whole fish i'm kind of on an angle but i'm gonna take certain uh, features like the teeth here uh the details so this thing is almost done being uh rendered as a drawing a final product and uh, something that I'm noticing that I'm getting into is this tail area. If you like, look at the salmon, it's actually just part of this area. And I'm not going to make it as so noticeable as the salmon on this. So it's just going to come up right along the edge. This is a big, 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 big carving. But uh, honestly, it's going to look pretty awesome when it's done. I might give the guy his money back. <laughs>